today in the kitchen with Angie the Pie Lady because Halloween is a perfect time for sweet treats and you have a great idea. Uh, yeah, I actually, it's not my idea. I saw it on Pinterest, I think, but <laughs> whatever. Um, it's mm. just little jack-o'-lantern pumpkin hand pies. Great. It's a really easy treat to make with your kids at home or just for a little fun at the office, whatever yes. you want to do. And Angie, what we know of you is that you really like to make a ton of stuff from scratch, yes. right? But yeah. today, though, you're cutting corners, too. Yeah, I'm using the pre-made <laughs> pie dough. I'm, I'm not proud of it, but... But it does make this project a lot easier. Yes, so, it does. All yeah. right, so what do we do? So when you get your box of pie crust, it comes with two, you roll them out. You gotta let them soften a little bit. Okay. Otherwise it kind of breaks up. So make sure they're up to room temperature. And then I'm gonna actually have you, I cut out most of these already. Right. But you can carve a little face. Ooh. And while I mix up, this is just um, pumpkin, pumpkin pie spice, uh, brown sugar, a little salt, and a little heavy cream. And that is the filling. Like there's, it's not like a traditional pie that takes forever or makes a giant mess to, to Yeah, make. and I think that that's great too, especially given the fact that Halloween is tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people might be like, oh, I really want to do something fun, but I just don't have time to yeah. really put a lot into baking. I'll this would be a, nice and easy. There's a lot of really beautiful cookies out there. That's, that's not my strength, but um, those are kind of intimidating to me and hard, but I don't know. These are well, super easy. Pies to are make, intimidating so. to a lot of people, but they're. <laughs> You, you, make, you make it approachable, Angie, and something that people can do. pie crust, yeah, it's okay. pretty simple. All right, so I've made a cute little jack-o'-lantern. My, okay. my triangles are not matchy-matchy, but you know what? It's you okay. You know what? You did okay. It's going to taste the same, right? Yep. All right, so you got your pie crust nice and warm, mm -hmm. or room temperature, like yes. you said. You've punched and, out your shapes. And you actually want to do that before you mix up the pie filling, then just okay. stick it back in the fridge while you're mixing this up. But as you can see, this like took two seconds to make, okay. maybe a minute. And then uh, we're gonna brush, you brush each of the pie doughs, just a little bit. You just get a little egg wash on there so that when you put the top on, they stick. Okay, easier. and then you do that before you put the pie filling yeah. on. Yeah, some people do it after, but I think it makes a giant mess. So okay. this is a lot easier. Oh, I like it's it, you're just, using a little melon scooper. Yeah, so it's just like a little, maybe Perfect. a tablespoon of filling. And I like that you're being exact because for people like me, I love to over stuff mm -hmm. and then it just... It makes a big gushy mess. Exactly. And no one wants a big gushy mess. So then you just, I, I found it's easier if you start pressing down towards the bottom first. Okay. So then you get a good seal on the outside. Nice. And then I did this one. It's just a little, like a couple of parentheses almost on the... Cute. And yeah. then if you want to brush those with a little egg wash. You got it. And then I've got a couple choices. There's like the coarse sugar, there's the sanding sugar, cinnamon sugar, or I did some with little gold flecks. I thought that was kind of fun too. So. Nice. So you can decorate it yeah. however you'd like. Yeah. I'm going to keep decorating the middle, these. Middle part too. And do you want to pull the finished product out of the I oven? actually, this is the finished product. <gasps> right here. Yeah. I just, Marvelous. they came out early, so I went ahead and got them done. And Look then, at that. So yeah, it's Let's super get a simple. Lovely shot of these thing. Oh my goodness. And Angie, which one do you suggest that I try? Um, I'm definitely going. I'm feeling a face for you. A face yeah. for me? Yep. Okay, I'm going to take the happy one. Okay. Here and we these go. just, they bake Diving in. 400 for about 15 or 15 minutes. Just mm. Oh. Golden brown. That's fantastic. Oops, I think I just broke something. <laughs> I'm so excited. I got so excited over the pie. I did. I just, I couldn't help it. All right, Angie, people are going to be able to find this recipe yep. on Ido Today's landing page at ktvb.com. Yes, and I mm. actually, there's another little part of that where you can throw some cream cheese in there, too, if you want to get super fancy. Okay, awesome, yep. but easy, done, and delicious for Halloween. We'll be right back. This is fantastic. Thank you, my friend. Mm -hmm.